I kind of want to explore a bit before following the trail. <laughs> Aha, that's why you explore. Docks. Limehouse dock. What's that? Your city, you life saved by efficient medical aid is a blow stuck at the blank of the flu epidemic. Volunteers make the difference. Oh, this door is open. Let me guess. This is my final destination. I see a bloody hand right here. Okay, let's check here as well. Oh, that's it. That's it. Cannot enter. Oh, come on. It's locked, all right. Do there we go? No on? One in sight. Do we go and check this house? I'm going to go check the house. What? Nobody at home. I will return later. Okay, okay. The game wants me to follow the trail first. Okay. Let's do that. Where has everyone gone? Blood here. Up. What's that? It's a rat. There's a box. Aluminum chart. Okay. A new hideout is avail available in this district. Check out on your map location. Ah, so the red door is a hideout. Okay. I guess we can save. We just found a new hideout. Here you can spend your XP while resting and craft items at the workbench. Okay. Craft medicine. When I work with you can craft medical treatments, serums, weapon upgrades. Serums boost yourself, medical heal sick citizens, weapon to improve your customized weapons. Treatment for fatigue, treatment for anemia, sepsis, treatment for sepsis. We don't we don't have enough. Firearms we can we upgrade to level two? No. We need um yeah some screws five screws. Okay, we need five screws. Refill ammo. We haven't used our pistol once. How can we use the pistol though? T and G. I don't know, should we rest? Let's do it.
I'm gonna get the clothes as well. We don't have enough. We need a thousand, okay. We found some blood up here. But to where next? Okay, he went down here. And I saw a box here as well. Let's go check it first. Oh, we got this one. Oh, that's it. Trash. Torn a page of a diary. For looking away when they mock my color, I hate myself. For crying like a girl when they insult me, I hate myself. For swearing like a boy when they are gone, I hate myself. For hating my parents, I hate myself. For smiling when customers call me sad Brina, I hate myself. For never finding the courage to tell Tom how I truly feel, I hate myself. Okay. Brina, Sabrina Cavendish, new hint available. You just discovered a hint, it reveals a secret about a citizen or someone related to them. Citizen menu. As a vampire, you need human blood to evolve. The blood quality bar indicates the XP you will earn if you feed on this citizen. Unlock hints, increase the amount of XP. Hmm. So if we unlock four, hence the blood quality will increase. Sabrina hides her true feelings about her boss Tom Watts. Why is he walking like that? He's walking dramatically. <laughs> Do you hear someone cough? I hear someone cough. I know I heard someone cough. Let me follow the blood trail first. I don't wanna... Oh. Two citizens in here. Sabrina. Sabrina is in here. What's that? Britons working together, skilled worker in engineering and kinder trades enrolled today as a war munition volunteer. Support the men at the front with a plentiful supply of munitions. You will not suffer in wages. Get into factory line and feed the firing line. Okay. They're hiring people to work in the factory. Would you like to know more? Ask the nearest recruit officer. Your army needs you. Okay. The army needs people. And I guess we came from here. We came from up. Let's go inside. At last, a little life. Welcome, sir, to the Turk Wars Turtle. My oh, God, sir, you look like Jonah's whale just spat you out of hell. Can I get you a drink? No, thank you. I'm not. Not thirsty. Well, grab a chair and get some rest. This is going to be another long night. A long night? How can I choose? Okay. Why is it going to be a long night? You must be new around here. Don't you know about the murders? Uh, 
Uh, Tell me more about these murders. Every morning for the last few weeks, bodies have been found. And those poor sods didn't die of flu. Uh-oh. Any leads on a suspect? Do the police have any leads on a suspect? Ah, even before the outbreak, coppers never came round here. We're on our own. People die in these parts all the time, and no one cares. Oh, no. Okay. What is this place? Where am I? Where is this place? You're at my bar, sir, the turquoise turtle. The last ray of light in this dangerous part of town. Aren't you scared? Aren't you scared? Scared of what? All the bad shit happens out on the foggy streets. <laughs> and I never go outside. <laughs> Are you open all night? So you're open all night? Yep. Figured people might need a place to rest in these dark times. How nice of you. I'm looking for someone. I'm looking for someone who might have passed through here recently. Wondered if you might help. It's been quiet tonight. The only other person I've seen went straight up to his room. <laughs> Thought it was kind of rude, actually. You mean he's still here? Well, yeah. He paid for the entire week. How long has he been here? How long has he been here? He rented the room a few days ago and didn't say when he'd leave. Okay, a few days ago. Who is this man? Who is this man? What does he look like? Well, like a gentleman, I guess. Well dressed, quite polite. A professor or something fancy like that. Always writing, reading notes. I need to meet him. I need to meet this man. I have questions. Just climb the stairs and knock on the first door. I heard him open his window, so I guess he's still awake. And, uh, yes, no funny business. You hear me? This is a respectable establishment. <laughs> what do you mean by funny business? There's gotta be something can be done to get out of this bullshit mess. No? You again. What can I do for you? Are there any new dialogue? I don't think Thank so. Thank you. Goodbye. Are they stupid or something? I've never even been to India. Hello, good sir. Good evening, sir. I wondered if I could ask for your help. Wow, you look like you need a drink. Yes. I apologize for my outfit. It's been... It's been a long night. Been there, seen that. Don't worry, things can only get worse. Uh, what's going on around here? What's going on around here? It's like everybody is hiding. You must be new here. Have you not heard about the murders? Everybody fears the return of the sewer dog. Who is the sewer dog? Who is the sewer dog? It's a local bogeyman. Convenient answer for every crime that happened for decades. You murdered someone. Blame the sewer dog, eh? Hmm. Is it just a fairy tale? You make it sound like it's a fairy tale. <laughs> People will always believe in monsters. It's easier than accepting their own darkness. We can all be monsters. So someone is living in the sewers? <laughs> uh, did anyone enter the bar? Has anybody entered the bar recently? I can't say. Sorry. I spent the night making love to that gorgeous <laughs> bottle, see? This is important, sir. Are you sure no one has come in here in the last few hours? I don't know and I don't care. This is a free country. People still have the right to come and go, don't they? Okay. I'll leave you to your bottle then. You're a hopeless case. Let's talk to this girl. Hello, sir. Sabrina. Are you alright? Is there any way I can help you? I don't know. Maybe you could just talk to me. Maybe you prefer to speak with Tom then. He's more agreeable talking to strangers. Um, what's going on? What's going on around here? Where is everyone? Too many dead, sir. First the epidemic, and now all these terrible murders. What about the murders? The murders? What can you say about them? Bodies found in the streets every morning. Every morning. Drained of blood. It's just horrible. Some say the sewer dog is back. The sewer dog? What's that? No one knows. 
people have always disappeared around these parts. The ancients say it's the sewer dog coming out to feed. But now he's killing in the streets. What about the epidemic? What have you heard about the epidemic? It's a Spanish flu. Yeah. Killed so many last summer. Thought we'd seen the last of it. Dozens dying every week. Are the authorities doing anything? Nothing. There are so many quarantine zones in London now. It's gotten really hard to travel across town. Oh, damn it. Um, what is this place? What is this place? This is Tom's Bar. A turquoise turtle. I'm the barmaid here, Sabrina. If you want to know. Always open at night. Are you always open this late at night? No, it's only since the epidemic started. Tom thought that people may need a safe place to stay. Uh, that's actually kind of him. Where is everybody? You don't seem to have much business. Where is everybody? Well, most people are sleeping right now. And those that are awake tend to avoid going out. What with the murders and all. I just want to talk. I just want to talk. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm not afraid, sir. It's just I've other customers to take care of. I only see one customer. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. Of course. I mean, I'll best check on them. <laughs> I'll leave then. Thank you. Okay. She doesn't want to talk to me. Go. This sort of mess would have given me a laugh. This. Jack? Who's Jack? This Jack? There's gotta be something can be done to get out of this bullshit mess. No? Dyson. Sabrina. I hope I live long enough That's to see them wet boot boys get what's coming off. to them. With with boots boys to see what's coming to them, okay. What have we got on the menu? Rita, Amder, old dog, Ruster, old house. There's gotta be something can be done to get out of this bullshit mess. No? Any, any secrets? He didn't deserve this. Jack? Who's Jack? Is there anything hidden here that I can find? Okay, no. Let's go upstairs and knock on the first room. I bet he will not be in the room. He will be outside the window. This is no place for you. Prewen has several patrols roaming the area. They do not pursue me. But they're looking for vampires and they're most efficient. They'll not relent until the killer has been identified. I have a common objective, but I require them. I think someone is eavesdropping. Are you certain? You might as well come in, whoever you are. Slowly, vampire. <coughs> Who are you? I, I mean you no harm. Say it, the vampire. Present yourself. Oh, no. I... I need a word. Anyone. The power of that cross compels you. Well, that's something I can do for you. There was another vampire here a moment ago. A woman talking to him. And who might you be? Dr. Edgar Swansea. Pillar. Fatigue. Treatment for fatigue, cure with fatigue. This guy, Tom Dyson is fatigued. Tom is healthy, 
Uh, Sabrina is healthy. Tom is fatigued. Okay, we found the pillar of this uh, um, location, unknown district. Okay. I don't know. You first. No. I don't know. I'm not sure that I know anymore. Might I at least learn the reason of your presence? That's none of your concern. What? Sir, you have entered my room in the middle of the night, pale as a corpse and shaking like a tree. So please, indulge me. Something, someone, is molesting people. <laughs> in fact, killing them. Biting them. The calling card of a vampire. Like you. I am a victim too. I've been hunted down in the streets and attacked. I'm a victim here too. I... I believe you. Then if you are not a vampire, who or what are you? Dr. Edgar Swansea of the Brotherhood of St. Paul. I am performing an independent investigation here in an attempt to understand precisely what is going on. Uh, what is the Brotherhood? And what exactly is this Brotherhood? Sir, if the name is not familiar to you, then we shall discuss it another time. Okay. <laughs> what do you know? What have you uncovered concerning the murders? It started a few nights ago. Rumors of violent murders. The docks have always been, shall we say, somewhat unsavory. But this is different. How different? A vampire is at work here. Famished. Reckless. It must be brought to ground, and quickly. Hmm. Who were you talking to? I heard another voice, that of a woman. Who were you talking to? Ridiculous. I've no idea what you're talking about. Oh, his lying tells me not to trust you. Then the feeling is mutual. Oh no. He's lying. He's lying. Help me then. Then help me find the culprit. I may. If you'll first tell me why you opened this door. I followed a trail. The scent of blood from a recent victim. It led me here. You thought I was your aggressor. That explains a great deal. We are both chasing the same shadow. What? I'm not sure. Perhaps. This is all new to me. I'm not even certain what I'm looking for. You should let me handle this affair. You've no idea what you're up against. No. I will find the monster. He is mine. How will you do any better than I? But then let me ask you this. What are your intentions if you find the killer? Talk to him. I'll end him. I don't know. I'll demand answers. I will at last have the answers to my questions. Hmm. Then I can only wish you good hunting. And pray we shall meet again. What? That's it? Interrogate the locals. I'm certain we shall meet again. Is it okay if I steal all your money? They're stupid, stupid or something? I've never been to India, Sabrina is saying. <laughs> yeah, there was another person here. Where the hell did they go? He was lying to me about it. Okay. 